Hello and welcome back to Just Be Better, bro. Two videos in one week. It's wild. I guess you can say I need a lock in, bro. I need to go in my in my winter arc. I've been seeing people talk about the winter arc all over Instagram, all over TikTok. I've been cringing a lot, so I thought, why not react to it? Why not roast it? And why not see what my audience thinks about the winter arc? Let's start off with the uh, three winter arc rules that you must know. Winter arc is starting tomorrow, so here are the three rules you need to know. Number one, you got to go the buzz cut route. Oh, but Germ, don't you have hair right now? It's funny because I'm actually cutting my hair too. Oh, hell no, nah, bro. Oh, hell no. Nah. I'm already failing this winter arc. I'm not getting no fucking bus cut. What's wrong with you? What does getting a bus cut have to do with locking in? Well, you're gonna save two extra minutes in the morning because you don't have to worry about your hair. Bro, that's so that's so dumb. You know what I do for my hair, bro? I, I put water on it. I wake up, I go brush my teeth, I put water on my hair, and then I use my towel, and then I just I just mess it up. I just do that and then I fix it. Like you don't need a 10 minute routine to take care of your hair. Like you just need some water. We're men. Where men just put on some water and then you're good to go. Getting a bus and looking bald and looking like egg, it's not gonna make you lock in. That way you ain't even thinking about your hair. You're thinking about how you can level up yourself. Second is working out. Ain't no more of this. I work out three times a week, bull. Bro, you need to be in the gym at least five times a week. And if you don't even got no six pack, bro, you need to be in there seven times a week. What are you doing, bro? Three months left of the year. And your physique is still cooked. Five times a week is generally a good rule, but obviously some people are busy. Some people are actually being productive and making money. So as long as you go like three times a week, that's decent. Obviously, those three times a week need to be good workouts. You need to maximize your time in the gym and maximize your actual movements. Like squeeze the muscle all the way and then on your way down, control the weight because that's how you, you maximize your workout and your time in the gym. We're moving forward. And the rest of these people that aren't locking in are cooked. He thinks, he thinks, cause he's going a winter arc from October to December. He's gonna get ahead of so many people, bro. You might. I'm not here to demonize putting in good work, right? Two months of good work is better than no work at all. But, bro, if you're serious about this, you're not gonna go on a winter arc, and you're gonna go on a whole year arc, bro. You're gonna lock in the whole year. New flings. This is so important. People need to stop hyping up the cuffing season, bro. Not during winter arc. That's cooked. If you waited this long and you still ain't got no girlfriend, I ain't gonna lie, you cooked, bro. Better luck next year, champ. Right now, it's time to lock in so you can actually get you a baddie next year. That's the dumbest shit I've ever heard, bro. You still got time to get a girl right now. Like, October October is one of the best times to get a girl, bro. Just take her to, I don't know, a pumpkin patch. Go to Halloween festivals. Go ride the Ferris wheel and see all the pretty autumn leaves, bro. Like, winter and October and fall. It's the best season to have a girl. And what does getting a girl have to do with locking in, bro? Getting a girl is the one of the most fulfilling things in life. Like, humans are social creatures and they need a social partner. That's one of the basic needs of being a human. So, eliminating that, what's that going to do, bro, to your life? Getting a girl adds extra motivation, at least to me, right? Which is the good way to see it. Of course, you can get a girl and become a lazy ass motherfucker and get complacent and stop trying in life and in the gym and in your goals. But that's just something wrong with you, bro. Like smart people are going to get a girl and then get more motivated. People who say this just say it because they're single and they're lonely and they want you to be single and lonely too so that they can feel better. And they want an excuse to say that they don't got a girl, right? They want to say, I don't got a girl because I'm locked in and I'm on my winter arc, so I don't want a girl. In reality, they just can't get a girl. Hey there. exactly <laughs> exactly bro you look like an egg this is what i'm talking about bro when i'm saying winter arc is corny and it's a meme and it's brain rot because people make edits like this now some people make it as a meme and some people make it on ironically and i think this guy made it on ironically bro like he for real thinks he looks cool shaving his head you don't look cool bro your, your hair was all good now you just look like a neck. This is not me dissing bus cuts. Some people look really fucking cool with bus cuts. And I respect that. If you can pull it off. But people like you and me, bro, we can't pull it off. That's why I'm not getting no bus cut, bro. If I get a bus cut, I'm going to look like the shiniest egg here. The winter arc. It's day one. This is your fourth quarter. Everything that happened prior to this, throw that shit out the window. Three months is all it takes. And bro, it's gonna get cold out. Trust me. You gonna fold? 
you gonna weather the storm. Like I said, I'm always down for influencing and motivating people, but why do gym edits and gym motivation always have to be so dark? Like, it's always a guy with a hoodie and sweatpants, and he's over here crouching down like he's ready to go to battle, ready to go to war. He's having dark thoughts. He's gonna fight through the cold. It's a battle, and are you gonna make it out alive? Like, bro, you're going to bench 105, all right? Like, chill. I don't know why the gym community is so obsessed with everything being dark and being like locked in in this battle inside your mind and having dark thoughts and and all that shit like let's not romanticize this shit bro why don't we actually preach like living a good life and being happy and being being optimistic having a, a good mental health bro it depends on the days bro like sometimes you do need that energy to like you know want to lock in and fight battles inside your mind and all that shit and just go solo in the gym but other times, you also just want to hang out with your boys, right? And uh, push some weight together and have fun and laugh while you work out with your boys. Like, it depends on the day, too. I, I do both of them, but I don't want to romanticize either or. Hey, there. Are you for real? I'm still alive and kicking. No wonder getting a girl in the winter arc is forbidden. Because you can't get one anyway, bro, with that shaved ass head, bro. Winter Arc, bro, it's not a double XP event. That's what I'm saying, bro. Like, they think these three months is going to double their XP. It's not going to take you to level 100, bro. It's going to take you to, like, from level 1 to level 2. Shit, we got girls on the Winter Arc 2 now. This is going to be interesting. This is going to be interesting. I thought it was only men going on the Winter Arc. <laughs> okay, so she, she just went to the gym. Which is one of my main problems with uh, this winter art thing because this is mostly for people who already go to the gym. They already go to the gym and now their winter art to improve their life is them locking in and still going to the gym. Like, bro, you're not improving anything. You're not changing everything. Like, you think you're locked in. You think you're going to change everything. But you're adding one thing which you already had. So you're not adding anything, bro. Or how about you get another job or you uh, start your entrepreneurship journey. You start your Shopify store. Do something else other than just going to the gym because you already do that. So I'm just going to say the winter arc is not bad by itself because it basically just means logging in and bettering yourself, which I always promote. But the videos promoting it make it so cringe. And the official rules for it, like, that don't make sense, bro. Like cutting your hair, like I said, unnecessary. Like, the things you're doing are not going to lead to results. Going to the gym and hitting a workout five times a week, that is amazing. And I preach that and I respect that. But that's not going to lead to no results, bro. Most people already do that. Most, most people already do that. So, what's the point of this winter arc if you're just going to continue living your lifestyle? And then third, don't talk to new girls and don't get a girlfriend during this time. Like, <laughs> what are we doing, bro? Are we still scared of girls? Are we still afraid to talk to women? Do we still need excuses to not have a girlfriend? Like I said, fall and winter are amazing to spend it with a girl if you can get one, bro. All the fall activities, the winter, the presents, all that sh all that cute stuff. So I don't want people to miss out on that just for the sake of a winter arc and being locked in. If you have the opportunity, please take it. Please take it and please enjoy it. Like I said, I will always preach self-improvement, but I will also preach happiness to my viewers because I want everyone to be happy. I want everyone to succeed and I want everyone to be fulfilled. Thank you for watching. You can follow the winter arc if you want, but don't do all the dumb stuff like cutting your hair and uh, not talking to girls, you know? Thank you for watching. Lock in and just be better.